What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you've been here, welcome back. If you've not been here, my name is Jojo, as you can see from the channel name down below. So I just got this little microphone, okay, not little, this big microphone here. I decided to make a little investment in this channel, uh, seeing that the subscriber count is growing. I appreciate each and every one of you. Uh, we've hit 400 subscribers and we're going on to a thousand. So I just decided to treat myself to something, you know, treat myself to some good equipment. So next up will be the the camera and the lighting. That situation is not very good. Uh, so my lighting is a bit wonky, but you guys are not here for tech. I'm so sorry. If you want the full tech review, by the way, for this microphone, I've got a separate little tech channel. You can go check everything out, all the specs and everything for all the equipment that I use for the channel. Link in the description box down below. Yes. So we are going to do Bojack season one, as usual. <laughs> Just started the show the other day. Season one, episode four. Um, I don't know what this one's called, but I'm super excited. I think Zoe Zeldas or something like that. Last time we left, left at a cliffhanger when um, we found out that the paparazzi took pictures of Bojack and Sarah Lynn. So that was a big deal. Um, so yeah, I'm looking forward to see if they carry on with that or they put that plot line aside and then it will come back to bite his ass like later on. Anyway, enough with the intro. I'm just so excited about the mic. Okay, I need to put it down. <laughs> I've got some iced coffee here. Grab your drink, grab your snacks and let's get down to Bojack Horseman. <sighs> right. Okay, was that him? Stuff felt like that flew over your head. Something the only thing we're gonna get is our money back. <laughs> okay, but then how do I know if they got it? They'll laugh. Why? Yeah, are that's you true. Giving me advice? Stand up is so hard sometimes. Big shots like me to Big always shots. be looking out for the little guy. Let me buy you a drink. <sighs> oh, I don't drink. Uh? Jack Horseman. What? Bojack Horseman does not drink. Since when? Oh, he started this, like, later on. I didn't know that. Oh, That's... I don't drink. What? Oh, Jack <laughs> Look at him God now. God damn it, you don't give me any closet space. <laughs> oh my God, he's having cotton candy with Fruity Loops. That's interesting. Has anyone ever tried that? I've never had Fruity Loops in my life. I should try. <laughs> A better man than you once. I like cotton I candy, though. The we love the intro. <laughs> Zoe or a Zelda title card Wayne's writing an article about me for BuzzFeed Wayne is also my ex-boyfriend <laughs> How could you think that that's the same in between an animated gif of a cat falling asleep and a list of fun facts about legally blonde <laughs> Classic Zo True Zoe. Oh Zoe <laughs> Wait are they taking the piss out of um BuzzFeed the Peanut Butter's house featured a pair of twins oh. Zelda was the sunny, fun-loving extrovert Zoe was the smart, cynical oh. introvert Halloween costumes are a gateway to casual racism Damn I so Oh, I love the colours on his shirt And, I mean, all the colours actually They're very, like, 90s It's a 90s sitcom Duh But it's giving me, like, Fresh Prince of Bel-Air Like, those older shows uh, I like that vibe. Believe yeah. Either a Zoe or a Zelda. Do you guys think everyone's a Zoe or a Zelda? Because I feel like we all have parts of that inside us. I feel Zoe like I have a bit of both. I think I'm above this. Said Zel Zoe. Zoe. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't have any prospects. I oh, no. Never finish the rock opera I'm working on. He was working what? on a rock opera. What? Yeah. Bojack is a pretty Zoe. He's a Zoe, definitely. Very cynical and very like, yeah, bringing the mood down and stuff. Wow. Todd is definitely a Zelda, Zelly Belly. PC is a Zoe. Mr. Peanut Butter is obviously a Zelda. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> it's just my thoughts. Utopia Rising, book, book one. one. Far away from home. Oh, look, PC is on her phone, guys. I mean, I'm out so PC's on her phone. She's busy. I told you, she's just like a workaholic. Rich with loam. Mm, loam. loam. Rich with Haven't heard that in a while. Loam soil. Loam. Yeah, it's a kind of soil. Yeah. People are simple Good for farming. <laughs> on a spaceship. <laughs> PC's 
got two phones. I got two phones. I got two phones. One for the beaches and one for the dogs. She's like double working now. Just say slaves. <laughs> slaves. Yeah, Bojack would not do well in um, the theatre. Like musical theater and stuff, I don't think he'd enjoy that very much, would he? <laughs> Mr. Peanut Butter, was, on the other hand, worse than a hundred September 11th. Yeah, wow, this man did not. No, I'm not man. This horse did not just say, it's filled with saying, this horse did not just say, he did not just say, worse than 11, 109 11th. That is so harsh. Poor Todd. September 11th. Yeah. Don't you're right. Crush That's his dreams. I don't know. I mean, didn't you have anyone Potential. You, you were just starting out? Um, actually, no. Oh, I mean, look at the pictures in the background. You can see the guy from the comedy center there. He's the one who helped him. I'm sorry, guys. This lighting is really irking me. Let me just try something else. I've tried to modify my lighting, so change of lighting. Do you let him stay here because you're kind or just because you're terrified of being alone? <gasps> that is insane! Oh, she is getting personal. She's like, because you, you're scared of being alone. You're scared of being all alone. You know what I thought? I thought that he wanted Todd there just to kind of feel like he's a good person, you know, to kind of stroke his ego and say, I'm helping this man who has nowhere to go and he lives in my place, so I'm a good person. But it might actually be because he's scared of being alone, deep down. That is a good sentiment. I, I like that. Love to be alone. Is that Diane like a psychologist or what? She's reading people here. If that were really true, I don't think you'd be clipping Todd's wings all the time. What? That's unbelievable. <gasps> That's why he's clipping his wings, because he doesn't want Todd to leave and then he'll be alone. That makes sense. I, I don't understand. Wow. Oh my god, are you dying? No. <laughs> I think I wish <laughs> you I died. Injury. Like that time you promised to take me ice skating and then you took the strippers ice skating? No. Then hooray! Bro took <laughs> strippers ice skating, I'm dead. <laughs> are you close? No. How about now? No. Okay, mute button. My parents are in the sitting room, guys. Oh wait, did he know? You're not even inside of me. Oh god. No, he's not inside. <sighs> How is he not inside of me? What's going on? What is he doing? No. No. You're not even inside of me. Did you get there? He wasn't inside of her. How did? How would she get there? Oh my god. Okay, so you know in the second act closer when the Oh wow, he just walks into the room like that? Bro, you need to like knock or something. We <sighs> are in the Turbidian's dungeon. Imagine if the Holocaust happened every oh, no. four years like the Olympics. I would rather that happen than your rock. Album. Yo, this man needs to chill with those harsh references. First 9-11, then the Holocaust. Like, bro, stop it. That's so harsh, that's so mean. Oh, Poor Todd. That's not really a no. He and said, fact, rather that happen, if it happens, the like, the, happened like the Olympics. Years, like the Olympics. I would rather <laughs> that happen than your rock opera. Unless... Okay. They were working for Queen Darnisa, who gave them a post as, as a vassal state to the Greater Mid Kingdom. Well, don't just sit there. Whoa, they were on the same page for once. I'm happy. I'm excited. Oh my god, uh, is he back to his bad set? Oh, oh, you like that? Mute. It's <gasps> no, she wasn't outside. Wait, what? What is he doing it with? Did you get there? This man was having... Was having sex. I don't know if that will get me demonetized saying so much in my videos. <laughs> He's doing it with a freaking bed. <laughs> I feel like I'm in a fever dream right now. Todd and a Bojack getting along and Bojack doing it with a bed like what's going on so awkward uh, no did you get there what okay are what? they trying to show like he doesn't really need 
anyone to do it with. Like he's he's just like narcissistic and stuff. And whether there's whether Diane is there or not, or whether anyone is there or not, you know, he's good. And also, didn't they break up? Or are they those type of people who kind of just break up and make back up like the next day? I didn't get that. You just blew this thing wide open. Oh, he even had a smoke after. <laughs> His bed must be so nasty. I'm just saying. Is that Bojack and his dad in the portrait? Is that Bojack swimming and his dad looking at him? It's an interesting picture. Wonder who took that. It's a kind of special moment. And seeing from his flashbacks, we know his dad was quite distant. So, yeah. I wonder what, like, who took the picture and what happened you know will they show that in the future <laughs> let me know if it has any significance get but don't no me. spoilers no spoilers though yeah that's right <laughs> let's, let's take a break and get lunch Wait, get lunch get fool me twice fiddle dd i do believe that is the expression what no it's not fool me twice. shame on no fool me once shame on you me twice shame on me i don't know anyway why am i thinking about that how long does it take to write a buzzfeed article oh is wayne here because he wants to get back with diane <laughs> everyone wants diane you know i love diane harvest i don't blame them <laughs> her name is diane and your name is diane oh you guys are perfect for each other why did you ever break up <laughs> Why did they break up? They're getting to know each other. I remember and stopped playing until my mom threw me out of the house. You're not a screw up anymore. Damn, he became like a gamer addict and a bum. Taught to have a hit rock opera on your hands. I'm really glad you think that. Yeah, that's sweet. It's so odd seeing like a random bulldog with his pink sweater sorry i'm noticing the background it's good to also notice the surroundings you know um yeah he looks cute but like normally in other animations and films you'd see that as a pet you know with a leash around the neck so this is quite interesting with the owner but now that's not the owner it's just like they're different people Next for her. <laughs> ben Cleef is that? the biggest name in rock opera. Okay, think oh. of all the great rock opera. We have some very delicate pictures. Oh, you might no. have an interest in not getting into. Oh no, it's come back to bite him in the ass. Oh my god, this is it. This is it. Okay, brace myself. Be happy with my current long distance provider. <gasps> Thank you. What? Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm having lunch. Oh no. With my friend. But if you don't, don't blow them off. <laughs> Oh my god, don't blow, oh my god, I'm stressed guys, I'm so stressed. And they've developed the pictures already, oh my god. Sorry, my camera went off. This blue bed um, kind of reminds me of um, Mordecai and Rigby, Mordecai, from Regular Show. Do you guys watch Regular Show? It's a good chill cartoon. So Van Cleef gets here, look alive. This could be Todd's big break, so mm, clap really he's hard. He's really coming laugh out. Laugh at all the jokes, even if they're not funny. <laughs> but also, got you something. Oh, plane tickets? Yeah, to San Francisco. Oh. That's where the office <gasps> exhibit is heading next. Oh my god. Todd is neither <laughs> a singer nor a trained musician. In fact, he never even He's giving so many disclaimers. He's like, um, please just like it. We don't have the best equipment. That's me when I'm starting my YouTube videos. I'm like, the lighting is bad. My microphone is new. I don't know how to use it. I'm learning. <laughs> so please excuse that. My camera might die. <laughs> Five hours later. Wow. Oh. Damn. Bojack's really gotten into it. I'm proud. Yay. He is so snorty, you know? Like, those very highbrow um, critics. That's the vibe I'm getting from him. Oh. Damn, this man had a whole champagne bottle in his coat pocket and glass. What? Where'd he pull those from? I mean, I'm not mad. He can still find ways to surprise you. Yeah. Todd really rose to the occasion. No, it's you she's talking about. Yeah. So he has a little Zelda in him after all. Aw, that is true. See, I feel like everyone's got a bit of each. It's not like either or. But I guess you have more of one, I guess. Comment down below who you are. Are you a Zoya or a Zelda? I feel like I'm more of a... Perhaps Zelda? 
let me know. What do you think I am? Am I a Zoe or a Zelda? What this means. Oh, uh, you're oh gonna he's going to out. be alone. You have to yell, hey, Ty, clear up your shit. So great. Just great and also good. Virgil von Cleef. Wait. Presents Bojack Horseman. <laughs> presents Newtopia. <laughs> Rising Book 1. The Search for a New Utopia. A Todd joint. What? I thought it would be it presents Bojack Horseman, presents Todd, who presents. <laughs> anyway. It's no ho, not so ho. Nice touch. <gasps> oh, that was so cool! Is that a beaver with the teeth? That is so cool. I love how they're using the animals in the show. So good, so creative. They're not just like animals who are just fully human in characteristic. They have that animal instinct. I just love it. Anyway. Food. It's okay. all just happening so fast. Baby birds get pushed out of the nest. <laughs> it's not your fault. I thought he was ready. Not. Oh my your god. Fault. You're right. Oh Is my he... god. They actually had an example for that. I thought he was just saying like hypothetically. Oh my god. The mother looks so distraught. <laughs> so the bird fell and died or something right he or she wasn't able to fly <laughs> wow okay it's thanks for that brilliant it's not an autograph it's a contract class. mate read snacks and red bull i do get snacky you think of everything oh. <gasps> they said 8 12 7 11 8 12 that is clever. Hand me that Ronnie Mills Sapka single in the 10 cent bin. Capital <gasps> 7? This just came out. Oh. He'll get addicted to his video game again and get back to being a bum. Uh, oh put no. It down. This is no time for a relapse. Oh Look, no. Okay, I'll, I'll buy it now. Oh, but... it's like his drug. It's like the way someone's an alcoholic or, you know, whatever. That is, that's his addiction. Why did I give the example of alcoholic? An addiction is an addiction, yeah. I won't play it till wow. after I've written the new song. That's what Dad, everyone tells themselves. Oh, did he just Dad, grab that? A... Oh, is that a chameleon? Do you know what I thought would happen? I thought the chameleon would, maybe it's a lizard, but I thought the chameleon would kind of blend into the surroundings. Like they would play with that aspect of a chameleon changing its color. So I thought maybe, I don't know, when he touches a table, his, like, hands are kind of brown or something. Anyway, maybe it's not a chameleon, but that would have been a good touch, just saying. <laughs> oh, all sales are final. Damn. Mm. Smells like cheap plastic and child labor. <sighs> and child okay, labor. <laughs> Wait, is Decapitathon, whatever that is, is it a real game? Or is it just in that world, in Bojack Horseman's world let me know in the comment section down below please thank you no you're right of course thank you good night oh he'll play he's leaving him <gasps> 10 seconds bro he didn't even wait oh come on to Capitol. i thought it was something like really intense look at that contrast i thought like there was some actual like oh there's a head decapitating it seemed so hardcore oh come on to Capitol. Oh my oh. god. Wake up! It's the murder! <laughs> because it's a cockerel. A hen. Chicken. I wake up, it's in the morning, because they do. At 5am in the morning. Chicken. Very smart again, Bojack Horseman, the show. Damn it, Don't think our man oh is no. Wait! It's up all night playing some sort of... Videographic game. <laughs> I like how he was able to read that as soon as he saw him. He wasn't like, he was up all night, like he didn't get sleep or he had insomnia. He was just like, that's video games. I know how that looks. <laughs> oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. For wasting your time with this talentless imp. imp. Todd's worse off today, but you're worse off in the long run because you're gonna die alone and unloved, you Wait, why is he saying this to the guy? The guy's literally just. He gave him a chance, Todd flopped. It's not um, Van Cleef's fault, is it? Oh, is Bojack talking about himself? He's probably talking about himself, it's isn't he? Yeah, 
die alone and unloved. That's one of Bojack's worst fears, I reckon. It's so pompous. For a yeah, shut don't burn the bridge. Oh, he did the catchphrase. Um, was Sarah Lynn the one who was starting that catchphrase? Or was she copying Bojack from his show in the big, I don't know. But I remember her saying, suck a dick, dumb shits. And she left the house last episode. Hear my new catchphrase? Suck a dick, dumb shits. Or maybe he's cutting this opportunity, like completely cutting it off. So that Todd stays. <gasps> or did he know that the store had decapito whatever that game? And that's why he took Todd there. So that he acts like a good friend knowing that Todd would absolutely take, you know, the bait. Okay, I'm just like overthinking this right now. I need to just watch. Sorry. Get shut. All your stuff in the living room closet. Oh. Thanks, Because he wants him to stay there. Yes, I will get rid of. Gibberish! Have you just been mashing keys this whole time? <gasps> it's, a, it's a work in progress. He wanted to see Look, Diane. You should be with me. Oh. No. I've dated you. Mr. Peanut Butter is nice to me. Honestly, don't feel like Mr. Peanut Butter and um, Diane are compatible. Hot take. <laughs> but yeah, let's but see. You're so obviously a Zoe. Pretend you're a happy Zelda. But deep but down, I know you. Peanut Butter's <gasps> a Zelda. He's happy. Where is Bojack going? He's loving. But <gasps> Beast Buy. Best Buy. Beast Buy. I love this sort of um changes in the names that they're doing in the show 812 for 7-eleven beast buy best buy why do i know american shops i've never been to america don't know <laughs> i guess media right okay was i right is bojack the one who orchestrated everything we're zoe's let's see came in yesterday <gasps> no problem right he bought it at the best buy beast buy took it to their 7-eleven 812 and put it in the one cent pile so that he could buy and then took todd there to get it did he collaborate with that woman who was behind him and said could you pass me that cd I was right this guy is mad he wanted he wanted to look like he was helping Todd this whole time but he was he wants him to stay in the house so he's not alone oh my god that's mental the 812 <gasps> even the chameleon was in on it and the lady Thanks I was right character act. I feel good about what we did here Bojack what do you mean girl like it wasn't that deep I don't know what you're talking about this never happened. Oh. That's why he left him at night with the CD, knowing that he would take it. He didn't take it away from him and literally hide it. And that darkness is gonna come out. And when it does, I want you to call me. Okay, bro. <gasps> Mr. Peanut Butter was there the whole time. What? He said, I like that guy. I like that guy. You see how oblivious he is? That can be annoying for someone who actually is like quite intellectual and deep like Diane. Like having just an obliviously happy person around them. It's like, they're not compatible in my opinion. That's mad. Beast by. <gasps> it was like $90. Bro, that was expensive. <sighs> wow. Or a moment and a whore. Go deck. Lovely. Right guys, that was season one, episode four. We've seen a new character, Wayne introduced. I like when they introduce new characters. He was Diane's ex. He's that, he's giving me very San Francisco. <laughs> I'm saying that like I know anything about San Francisco, but like that very like, oh, I am sophisticated. Oh, like I like to go to, I don't know, the theater and drink wine and I, I taste wine and you know that vibe that people give, that very like, hmm, I look down on people who don't know who Van Gogh is, you know. We're a little more progressive and ahead of the curve here in San Francisco. <laughs> um, 
Can you believe all these imbeciles in Texas? They just put another prisoner to death. But yeah, even the way he's dressed and the glasses, the whole look just gives me that vibe. Anyway, that was a good episode. In the end, I figured it out right before it happened because I was like, that's too convenient. How did that game just ruin him? And the fact that Bojack was so nice all of a sudden, I was like, he, he can't just change. He was scared of being left alone, so instead he went out of his way to go buy the whole, the expensive video game to kind of put Todd in that situation, knowing that Todd can help himself. He'll play the game. And that's why he went to sleep at that time and left Todd there to his devices. If he really cared, he would be like, no, you're not buying this or I'm gonna take this away. Why am I saying that like he even was supposed to buy it? He actually went out of his way to literally go and buy it and hire actors and pay money to do all that. That was crazy. This is it's just mad to me to be honest. That really shows what kind of person he is. It kind of reminds me of like those parents who are scared of like their their children going into the world and so they kind of can sabotage their children's opportunities just to have them home it's not very common is it but i don't know why i thought of that mr peanut butter like even after that whole speech he was actually there sat there i was very surprised and he was just like yeah that's cool i like that guy you know like are you okay are you dumb are you foolish like it's just like don't you understand <laughs> what this guy this guy is flirting with your girl like take charge like be like no excuse me this is my girl now and i'm she's mine or whatever but he's just happy and nice and yeah, I guess that can be fun. He can be fun to stay with, but as a boyfriend or as a serious relationship, I don't think it would be very fulfilling for his partner. Also, Bojack and PC. That's just such a weird, like, <laughs> sex scenes. I was like, what? She wasn't even in the bed. She was like, you're not even in. <laughs> <laughs> that was really funny. PC literally was trying to sign Todd as an like to be his agent. So he could have been potentially successful because Mr. Van Cleef was actually rooting for him. So if he had been successful, he might even have been more successful than Bojack. You never know. But Bojack orchestrated the whole thing that he has no flaws in the whole situation. And Diane thinks he's a brilliant man at the end of the day and no one suspects anything and Todd is blissfully happy and carrying on with his life because he's a Zelda so he'll just sleep on the couch and carry on without thinking crap I need to try that again how could I let this video game take a hold of me he just like oh cool slaps on the couch without thinking twice about it but yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this reaction I'm just very excited about this microphone I'm enjoying it I feel like a podcaster or a real youtuber um <laughs> i am a real youtuber but yeah it's just yeah i'm just happy you guys are enjoying the content and subscribing and engaging with me in the comment section i really am happy about that and i'm really enjoying like having having chats with you down there so feel free to tell me anything down there and i will reply i reply to every single comment let me just know what shows you want me to react to i'm doing south park i'm doing bojack and i'm doing rick and morty for now and then I might also do Death Note. So yeah, those are the adult animations I'm currently on right now. Um, if you're a Rick and Morty fan as well, let me know in the comment section so I can kind of have an idea of what the demographic is. But I noticed that Bojack fans are very like strong in this channel. So welcome to the family. And we're gonna go along this ride and until we reach the end. I'm looking forward to see how, where this show goes because um, you guys say it's not that serious for now so it's gonna get super super deep so yeah I'm kind of scared but excited at the same time but yeah thank you so much for watching please hit the thumbs up button comment down below to help the algorithm subscribe for more content and to help the channel grow tech channel down below if you want to know anything about what I'm using for the film set and everything other than that I love you all have a great week have a good day goodbye Mm-hmm. <laughs>